Madame Gengos, speaking during the Commerce Regional Principals Conference in Vendok, commended the inmates for their contributions made towards the research. She, however, raised concern that it might not be possible to bring back religious education to schools, but suggested that the same teaching can be introduced in a more inclusive manner. You can remove the word religious. Call it something else. Call it moral instruction or call it values instruction. Remove references, direct references to the Bible, but the Bible speaks about principles that anybody has to believe in. It doesn't necessarily have to be called religious instruction. It doesn't necessarily have to require specific references to verses. Remove the verse, keep the content of what that verse is saying, and there you have it. Teaching such content will help children understand the difference between right and wrong, as well as good and evil, as children today seems not to understand that concept, says Gengos. They do things and they are genuinely confused when there's consequences. They really look at you like you're an animal, like why are you treating me so bad? The First Lady also pointed out the need for child rehabilitation facilities in the country due to high numbers of alcohol and drugs addiction amongst the youth. For NBC News, I'm Evelyn Paulus, Venduk.